morning my name is Moy I'm married to Prince Imtetwa our devotion for this morning is taken from the book of James chapter 3 verse 17 I will be reading from the NIV Bible but the wisdom that comes from heaven is first of all pure then peace loving considerate submissive full of mercy and good fruits impartial and sincere but my focus will be on the question of what it means to be impartial there is no other way other than to take it from the bible in the bible it says for god does not consider some people to be better than the others he treats everyone the same his love is unconditional his grace is unlimited there is one thing also I like that with God is not important what donation is your gender your background your history even your past we are treated the same God shows no favoritism I like James in the tra in, in the passion translation James chapter 2 the headline on, on its own it's a big huge light for us it says the royal law of love ex excludes prejudice and he says in verse 1 my dear brothers and sisters fellow believers in our glorious lord jesus how could we say that we have faith in him and yet we favor one group of people above the other it is pretty obvious when we are followers of christ we have to be impartial we have to treat people the same we must have no preferences let me make or let me share my experience I've been to a number of churches. There are some instances where one will be very shy because of the partiality that is um, practiced in the entire community. There is an incident that I will never forget where a couple really divorced because one partner was favoring the partiality side and the other partner could not love that. She loved the other part where people are treated the same. So in the entire Christian community, this has become a very sensitive issue. So, but we as followers of Christ, I think that this devotion is encouraging us again to be impartial, treat people the same and be the same face all the time when it comes to people. And then maybe I, I cannot exclude the parents because I'm a mom, as you all know, Last year, I have to adopt a beautiful young girl of the same age as my last born. Parents, we know, we tend to have favoritism when it comes to our children sometimes, especially the last born. We, t we tend to favor children. So last year, God just blessed us with a beautiful young girl of the same age as my last born. Hey, I was so tempted, you know, sometimes to be partial, sometimes to be impartial. But I have no other way. I have to follow Christ. I have to follow Christ's character, who is impartial, who loves people the same. So that is my encouragement and my inspiration for today to go back and check ourselves again and be impartial as our Lord Jesus Christ is impartial. Have an awesome, wonderful, bright Friday.